My First Bible presents oh? Gideon and the 300. <laughs> Jerubal, better known as Gideon, gathered 32,000 men willing to fight by his side. All of them woke up early and camped at Herod's Spring. The camp of the Midianites was at their north. Gideon knew that the men by his side would not be enough to fight the Midianites, since their enemies were much more than them. But God told him, You have so many men. What? How is that? You have so many men, so that I may deliver the Midianites into your hands. In order to Israel boast against me, and say that by their own strength they got rid of their enemies. So, tell the people that everyone who is afraid can go home, or get away. Gideon, extremely confused, obeyed the Lord's words, and told his men, so, the Lord says, everyone who is afraid can go home, or get away. Uh? Gideon, have you lost your mind? The Midianites are many more than us. Mm -hmm. The more men for the battle, the better. Yes, I'm living. I don't want to die in battle. Like that, 22,000 men went back home, and the only one left was Gideon, along with 10,000 men. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Gideon, worried, knew that 10,000 men was nothing compared to the Midianites' army and their allies. But God told him, You still have many men. What? B but Go, Go down, down to the, the river, river with them, and, and tell them to drink water. There I will tell you who will go with you, and who won't. Gideon made the men go down to the water. Then he told them to drink water from the river, and God told him, Pay attention, Gideon. Men who lick water like dogs, set them aside for the men who kneel to drink. So he divided them. Only 300 men drank water, taking the water to their mouth. Everyone else kneeled to drink. And the Lord told him, With these 300 men who licked the water will be saved by me, and I will give you the Midianites to you. The rest of the men will return to their homes. With 300 men. So, as God told him, Gideon told the rest of the men to go back home. Blah, blah, blah. But he retained the 300 men, blah, 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 those who blah, took blah, blah. charge of the provisions and the trumpets of those who were living. The camp of the Midianites was located in the valley below where the Israelites were. That night, God told Gideon, Get up and go down to the camp, because I will give you the Midianites. If you are still afraid to attack them, go down to the enemy's camp first with your servant Pura and listen to what they have to say, because later you will gain courage and strength to attack the Midianites. Oh. And like that, Gideon obeyed the Lord's words, and he went to the enemy's camp because he was afraid. Uh. So he and Pura 
His servant went down carefully, trying not to make any noise, uh. reaching the sentinel posts. Uh, no, 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 no. Shh. The sentinels were in charge of guarding the camp while the others were sleeping. Gideon and Pura arrived precisely at the moment in which a man was telling his dream to a colleague. And they approached to listen to their conversation. I had a really strange dream, he said. My dream was right at the camp. I was guarding when I saw a barley loaf coming down which came rolling and rolling and crashed hard into a tent at the camp. And the tent rolled over and fell down. When he heard this, the other man said, Oh, that's bad. This means nothing more than the sword of the Israelite Gideon, the son of Joash. God has given the Midianites into his hands and all the camp. What? It can't be true. What will we do? Blah, 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 blah. When Gideon heard the dream blah, blah, blah. and its interpretation, he oh. fell to the ground in worship. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, 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 then blah. he ran to the <laughs> Israelite camp and shouted, Get up! The Lord has given us the Midianites and their allies! Blah, blah, Quickly, blah, blah, Gideon blah, divided blah, blah, the 300 blah, blah, men blah, blah, into three blah, squads. Blah, 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 blah. He gave each one a trumpet torches and empty jars so that they could put the torches in it and hide their light. Blah, then blah, blah. Gideon explained, We will surround the Midianites camp and there you will do exactly the same as I do. As my squad and I blow the trumpets, you will do too, surrounding the camp and you will yell with all your strengths for the Lord and for Gideon. <laughs> at midnight, Gideon and the hundred men with him arrived at the Midianites' camp during the change of the guard. So Gideon, while holding the trumpet with his right hand and the torch in the jar with the left, broke the jar against the floor and played the trumpet. So they did, every man with Gideon. That's the signal! The three squads played the trumpets and broke the jars against the floor and yelled, Draw your swords, swords for the, for the Lord, Lord and for Gideon! Each Israelite stayed in its place and lights showed up surrounding the Midianites' camp. Meanwhile, the Midianites who were sleeping, shocked by the fuss, knowing what was going on, ran away and were screaming while escaping. When the 300 trumpets sound and seeing so many lights, God made everyone in the camp attack themselves with their swords, and many of them dropped dead at the hands of their colleagues. Who are you? You're an enemy! Die! Ah. Some few Midianites could run away, but the Israelites from Naphtali and Asher and the entire tribe of Manasseh were summoned to pursue the Midianites, and they caught them. And like that, Gideon understood that no matter how great the challenge, by trusting in God, he was able to defeat thousands of Midianite soldiers with just 300 men. Subscribe, like, comment, and follow us on our social media. greet our friends who have commented on our post. If you want a greeting in the next video, follow us and comment on the latest posts on our networks.
Instagram, and YouTube. The next greetings go to Innocent Chick 22, Alex Jimenez, Mackie Wacky, Suzanne Nickets, Abby 0611, Nykorgvi 6564, Will Hook, Ishmael Bikale from Florida, America, LV Matta from Australia, Jalisha Plays, Coral Marina from Maryland, USA, User EV8LNQL4R, Mrs. Red Riddle from USA, Co 4508 from New Jersey, Chris Molina, Kimberly Tobar from California, Ashbeck Kongnak, David from Philippines, Edwin Onea, Tara Cho from Indonesia. Thank you very much for all your great support.